Hi guys, so today I'm going to be showing you around Regent's Park, which is one of my favourite parks in London and also one of the biggest parks in the city. And uh, as you can see today isn't probably the best day to do it, it's a bit cloudy, a bit miserable, but we're going to see, we'll take a look around and I'll show you some of my favourite spots. There's actually, if you've got kids, there's a zoo here, uh, or even if you just like animals I suppose. Um, it's a great place to come for a run if you live around here. I, I run here even though I live probably about five miles away. I sometimes run all the way here, run around the park and then run back, which is a long way because it's a huge park. Uh, you've got sporting facilities here. Um, you've got, you can play tennis. Um, there's also some nice gardens, which I'll show you in a bit. So it's a good place to come and let's have a look around. So I'm just coming up to London Zoo and the sign's just over here. It's about £25 to get in, not too bad. I'm not going to go in today, I'm just going to try and see if I can see some of the animals from the road. What I thought I'd do is just try and get a few shots of the animals sneakily from outside the zoo. So I'll try and get some, maybe put the long lens on my camera, see if I can get some of the, the animals. I don't know what I can see from just the pavement outside. but. Let's give it a go. Okay, so it took me around 20 minutes just to walk down here to the lake. It's a very nice lake in the park too. Just a good place to hang out really. Um, it's actually called the Boating Lake and I think you can hire a boat if you really want to. Um, if that's your thing, that's cool. I've never actually done it myself but um, might be worth a try. From the boating lake I've walked probably about another five minutes and I'm now here in the in uh, Queen Mary's Garden which is in the middle, kind of the middle of the park. It's actually called the Inner Circle. As you can see it's pretty lush. It's actually uh, early April at the moment but um, it's been so cold and wet this winter um, so it's looking, it's looking like winter still. Uh, but you know in a few months it'll look really really good when all the the plants start blooming and the, the foliage starts to green up more so this is probably my favorite place in the park and it's called the japanese garden not very english i know but still who cares i really like it it's not that busy considering you're right in the middle of london and there's, there's some nice little paths in this bit especially which are just really secluded and you can just have a nice peaceful walk around. Well that just about brings our tour today to an end. I hope next time you come to London maybe you'll give Regent's Park a look. It's worth coming along, so easy to get here. I came today by Camden Town by the way there's three tube stops which you can actually take uh, which are within walking distance of the park so yeah next time you're here give it a go okay guys that's it for today hope you've enjoyed this uh, video if you do just give it a thumbs up below that'd be great so yeah take care see you soon <laughs> <laughs>